Yes. I've spent half my life in airless recording studios with no windows, no light. And we get here, and it's beautiful. And so what's the history of it? Well, it was built by Fred Carno in 1910, 1912, something like that. And, and his instruction was that he wanted the best houseboat on the river. And there were a lot of houseboats on the river in those days. He built it to be on that island right there, Tags Island, where he had a hotel, right. Carcino, mm. which is a cunning mix of the word Carno and Casino. And this was a massive sort of London meeting place. Fred Carno, he was the sort of... He was a musical empresario yeah. type character who discovered Stan Laurel and Charlie Chaplin and all these people. He kept his best guys, or what he considered to be his best guys here, and sent the others off to the States to be in his touring company over there. And um, they all got discovered and pinched. So do you want to look around yes, the rest of it? Yes, Benny, yeah. And then you can get back to the very nice song that they very nice. Yes, song. very, very good. You're to see that lavatory. <laughs> uh, but you can see this one. This, this is a very nice, it's a very nice bathroom, this yes. one. Amazing. We have made most of two Pink Floyd records in this tiny oh, room. Really? Yeah, Can so I be the everyone, first? Everyone in here playing the first stick, to play a chord. There's two little rooms out there yeah. um, which we stick guitar amps and things in so that we can... Um, well, you, you can't be playing the guitar in the background while they're doing that. Fucks up the edge. <laughs> Don't mind your head. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> that'd be me. Oh, yes! This was designed mm. with... Um, he, he wanted to be able to have a 90-piece orchestra on here. Man, he lived his life at a quite a pitch, didn't he, Frank? <laughs> Was this inspirational, this? I think we should write a song about our trip, don't you think? Yeah, I think we should probably have some more adventures first, though, shouldn't we? Yes. Yeah. I think this, this first part of the, this first day, you know. And then we met Dave Gilmore. That was it. That would be the first line See, of the David, day. I, yeah. David, I pulled my comedy face then when you said that, but luckily the camera missed it. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, You're dude. going to write a song about the trip? Yeah. Oh, right, OK. <laughs> don't tell him it's not worth it. <laughs> Might seem to let us in, relatively unannounced. <laughs> yeah, very good of him. When's the CD coming out? Uh, March, I think. You're going to buy it? Then? Yeah, I quite like it, actually. It's quite nice. Are you rowing or not? I'm just actually trying to work out where we are. We're almost at Magna Carta Island. Is that further than they did on the first day? On the day? first day, they, they became too magnetic. tired. Too tired they were. Well, we're to go this far tired on the first day. Are we, no, I'm very no, fresh. I'm just fighting. I read you from the book. Where are we yeah, from the book?